Hi guys, we are here at the Holiday Inn Club Vacation in Cape Canaveral. Um, we are entering our room. We're staying in 1520B. And here we go. So all rooms are pet free and they are also smoke free. But it's a nice big dresser to start off with. Nice little living area. You have a TV with a DVD player. That's kind of nice to have. Mirror. All right. So the couch does not have a hide a bed in it, but it says it sleeps four. So I'm not sure how that would work. So we're going to the bedroom. Nice little king bed here. Alarm clock. No USB charger on this side anyway. Lights. A TV. This one does a uh, joining rooms. And there's no plug on this side, so there's only one plug for the bed. All right. Now we're also going to look at the uh, has like nice little. Um, I don't know. You want? It's not really a kitchen net, but sink, coffee maker, and it has your microwave, refrigerator, your coffee. Oh, that's so cool! It's salt and paper shakers. That's cool. Sorry. Um, and it looks like you have some dishware and a toaster and then here's your mixing bowls and all that kind of stuff so does that mean it has a hot plate if it has strainers and stuff let's see nope huh so you can do a toaster so it's, that's kind of weird guys so they have mixing bowls mixing cup and all that but there's what would you use that for maybe dilute some tea or coffee or whatever I don't know but here's refrigerator moving in okay your AC unit here that's strange not trying to be negative guys it's just I've never had an AC unit like right there unless you're at Disney safe box actually this one's pretty big Wow, nice little storage. This is a vacation club, so you know they might have it where this for extended stays. Let's see what's in here. Oh, more bedding, your beach towel, um, your uh, pool towel. Oh, it goes far back. Wow, that's that's pretty cool. All right. Thermoset. We Amber and I usually stay around 68, 67. Whoa, guys! Holy cow! It has a jacuzzi tub. I think I'm going to be sitting here for a little bit tonight. The shower, not bad. Not bad shower. Full length mirror. Hi. Um, they got a plunger in the sink, extra towels, extra towels, drawers, and they do have a um, hair dryer. Huh? Wow. So from this side, it's really not that bad. It does have a privacy um, shade right there that you can pull up and down to open it up, but it's not horrible. Um, I want to say it's 149 a night to stay here So it's not horrible and I'll show you the amenities in a, um, after a bit Let me open up the pamph pamphlet real quick So your pamphlet comes in like this 
you get your your map which tells you where everything is it has a restaurant on board or not on board but you know what I mean um, has a restaurant here and it has um, itinerary and list of activities and plans that you could do nice little pamphlet and everything has your um, Wi-Fi and to enjoy the amenities they want you to be wearing this at all times you only get one per person max that would be in a room so for example this sleeps four so I'm only entitled to four of these but being that it's just me tonight I only need one but that's if I wanted to enjoy the amenities such as the pool they have putt putt and so on and so forth so I'll give you a, a hotel tour once um, I get done kind of relaxing. I just drove about three hours to get here, so I will see you guys after a bit. Oh, almost missed it. They do have a USB cord here, but it's not by the bed. So I guess it's all about your preference, what you guys like, what you guys don't like. Anyway, I'll see you guys after a bit, and I'll show you around. Well, this is set up, so you have two entrances for the same room number two 1515a 1515b this one does not i believe does not have a like an outside facing room light or window this one right here would so we are in one like this so we have a front facing not a back facing you know what's nice about here is you have under or cover parking you also have parking above so you get a parking pass for the length of your stay and it's pretty nice there's not a lot of people here but like I said people come here they park they don't have cruise parking so you can't park your car here long term if you're going on a cruise ship but you can however stay here before you go on your cruise ship they do like that for sure 